Hello, darlings. You've all heard of Marilyn Monroe. Some of you know Bridget Fardell. Well, now it's time for the cognac show. I said cognac, ooh, ooh. I said cognac, ooh, ooh, ooh. I'm your ballet blonde, fancy dress.
Jeff Willalane, and we're here at the home of Bro Bruce T. Sloan. We're celebrating Live Out Loud, sixth annual charity gala, and we're here in East Hampton, and it happens to be a beautiful day on 4th of July weekend. And I'm so proud to be speaking to Bruce. This is wonderful. This is the second year now that you've donated your house and your grounds for this wonderful event. Am I right about that? You are right. It's the second year that you've joined us. It's actually the sixth year. The sixth year that you've had yes. it at your house. Yes. Wonderful. I the event six years ago, and it's my pleasure. And it's my pleasure to have you back again. Well, tell my audience, what are we experiencing this afternoon? Well, first of all, the, a bunch of really wonderful people gathering to support gay, lesbian, transgender youth through our programs, the homecoming project. Uh, we give scholarships to five out gay kids. We bring people into schools. We bring people to corporations and to gay affinity groups. Just make them feel good about who they are. Tonight, we have a lovely cocktail party with a silent auction with absolutely amazing things donated by wonderful people. And then some lucky people get to stay for dinner afterwards. That's exciting. Now, how many people do you anticipate uh, coming to this event this evening? I'd say about 300 for the cocktail portion, and then the dinner is going to be about 150 people. Now, the silent auction, that ends at 8 p.m. Am yes. I correct yes. about that? Yes. Tell my audience, you are also on the board. Are I you? Board you're, tell my audience your exact title on the board of directors. Board member. <laughs> board member. <laughs> Not chair. I don't have the time for chair, but board member. Okay. Okay. Are we going to experience any surprises, anything new, or... Well, we'll have um, some interesting people coming. Jacqueline Larson is definitely coming back again. We have Terrence McNally coming. We have Joey Gonzalez from Barry's Boot Camp, who's also a sponsor. Uh, we have uh, Hal Rubenstein, who's a fashion icon. I love Hal. He's such a terrific guy. As well. yes. And his title is also board member. Board member. <laughs> and he's coming. And so really just wonderful people. Um, lovely people. Some happen to be major players. Um, and others are just lovely people as well. Well, this is a terrific event. It's one of the best events in the Hamptons, and I, I'm really so happy to be here this evening. Could you tell my audience, Bruce, where we could go to find out more information, how we can support, participate, and contribute to Live Out Loud? Absolutely. It's liveoutloud.info. Liveoutloud.info. And it's, the site explains everything, what we do, any questions with phone numbers, and uh, the staff or I would be happy to talk to you. Give me a kiss. And we'll be back in a moment with more interviews coming up right here at the 6th Annual Live Out Loud. Take share, take kisses. Preziosi, yeah. Leo Preziosi. So, Leo, this is wonderful. Six years that you have worked so hard. You founded this organization. It's doing amazingly well. Tell my audience about all the different programs that are available on Live Out Loud. Sure, sure. We have a number of programs that we produce in the um, tri-state area. And our whole mission is about connecting gay youth to role models in the gay community. One of our signature programs that we're very excited about is Live Out Loud's Homecoming Project, where we invite members of the LGBT community to go back to their high schools to inspire the next generation of LGBT youth. Um, another one that we're really excited about is behind the scenes, where we actually um, take students to companies like Google and HBO and NBC to meet people who are out at work to really show them what the possibilities are. And, and the that's possibilities exciting. are endless. And we're just opening up their minds to what's possible. Because I think we all know what a small world high school can be. So we're just trying to be a small interruption and say, like, this is possible. If you're interested in journalism, yes, you can be supported. You can work at, you know, HBO, NBC, The New York Bravo. Times. Bravo. Yes, bravo. 
Is Andy <laughs> Cohen, is he a big, I would think he would be a big supporter of this. Well, he's an incredible supporter in the LGBT community. Yes, he's I so know that. He's just an extraordinary man and just incredibly talented, so. And I had the pleasure of interviewing model. him uh, a couple of times already. I'd love to maybe interview him at this event wow, maybe one year. One we year. have to invite him, yeah. right, to come out. <laughs> so busy lad. tell my audience, are there any accomplishments or goals that you would like to you know, set forth in the new year? I think one of the biggest things that we're looking f to engage the community with, the LGBT community, is to not only participate and go back to your high school, but, uh, but to really create a, a, an ongoing relationship with your former high school. So if you go back once a year and then you encourage other alums to go back, I think that would be really, really incredibly impactful for the younger generation. Yeah, for all the students out there, for the next generation. Absolutely, absolutely. It's very, very important. If we can just be a presence in their lives, it would be a, a major, major impact. Very, very important. Very important. Tell my audience, where can we go to participate? Where can we go to contribute? And where can we go to support? What is the website? If you go to www.liveoutloud.info, um, there's many different ways that you can uh, volunteer for uh, us on a, on a program or on a committee and, and make a contribution so we can continue to grow our programs and to reach more LGBT youth. Thank you so much, darling, for that Thank wonderful you. interview. Thanks for coming out. And we're 13 years old this year, but this event, Live Out Loud Pride in the Hamptons, it's is six, six, years. Years. six years old. And who founded it but our, our board member, Bruce Sloan. So, bravo to Bruce. Bravo <laughs> to you, too. Thank you. Give me Thank a kiss. You. Thank you, Tanya. Thank you. Bravo, bravo. And we'll be back in a moment, darling. There's more interviews coming up. Keep watching. Keep sharing the interviews. Hello, darlings. You've all heard of Marilyn Monroe. Some of you know Bridget Fardell. Well, now it's time for the cognac show. I said cognac, ooh, ooh. I said cognac, ooh, ooh, ooh. I'm a buffet blonde, fabulously dressed to impress. It's been a Cry Baby Productions, darlings.